everybody. Welcome to the second episode of Cooking with Kathy. Look away. <laughs> okay. In honor of the football, er, in honor of the Super Bowl, I am going to help you make some fun Super Bowl party, a drink and a dessert. Make a cake and then we're gonna decorate the top with a surprise that I'll tell you about when we get closer. And then we're gonna do a signature drink while it's cooking, okay? So off we go. As you know, cooking is my forte. I'm amazing at it, so uh, get ready. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna grease the pans. So this is kind of grossing me out, but that's okay. I'm gonna do it anyway, because a good cake is worth it, right? Putting Crisco on the sides. I could have gone the easy route and done the uh, Pam spray on baking, but I decided to go all out for you, right? Show you all of my amazing culinary skills. Oh, wait a minute, is culinary baking or is baking just baking? Mm. Anyway, I don't know. off we go, off we go. All right, so we're gonna make a French vanilla cake. I decided to do a box cake because, well, who's got the time to figure out how to make a real cake? I mean, right? So funny story, my husband's my husband is you know, like super Italian and his mom used to make everything from scratch and then that poor boy married me. Like, he's a saint, what can I say? <laughs> Let me get all that oil out of my hands. Now I'm gonna put some flour on this. Oh, that was probably a lot, so I'm gonna just Around. I'll put the extra in the second one. How's that? Does that sound like a plan? Way too much flour. Into the sink. <laughs> See the <laughs> Look away. <laughs> All right. I got the cake mix because it's nice and easy. Straight out of the box. French vanilla, which I like. Of course, for this recipe, a cake, you could do chocolate, you could do vanilla, you could do white. Why you white is white cake, I'm not really sure, because yuck. Um, and so it gets, let's see here, water, one cup. I was a little short on that. And one third cup oil. I'm gonna be and pour it over the top, wish me luck. And eggs. Here we go. I hope my husband doesn't watch this video because he gets really irritated when I put eggshells into the sink. So, honey, sweetie, look away. All right. <laughs> so this is the easy part. The hard part is going to be... Okay, the hard part's gonna be the decorating. team is always obligated to eat my uh, amazing dessert. Well, I shouldn't say obligated because there's only the one Christmas dessert and that was like four years ago and now this. It really takes a special occasion to get me in the kitchen. So I'd much rather be selling out right? All right, I got a little bit everywhere, but that's okay. I'm not sure those are the right ones. I'm gonna put this in the oven. Okay. It's kind of not even, but I'm gonna go with it. All right, we'll put them in the oven. My dog Ranger is here to hope for, uh, hopefully something falls on the floor. Oh, I'm gonna set a timer. For our signature cocktail, since the Chiefs are on fire, we're gonna create a flaming Dr. Pepper. What? So, first things first, I have my fire extinguisher. I want my husband to be happy. Okay. I'm gonna get out my Guinness glass that I got on my trip to Ireland. And I only have one shot, which I got, which is from a Las Vegas shot glass. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix amaretto and a high proof rum and then drop it into a beer like a boiler maker. So here we go. I chose Bud Light. You can choose any beer you want. Ugh. Woo, okay. Here we go. Okay. 
That is not the way you pour beer, is it? It's been a long time since college, what can I say? <laughs> now, I'm not a big drinker. My husband tells me that Di Sirono is amaretto, so I'm gonna go with that. It's not, I'm not even sure that's how you pronounce it. And then we got some Captain Morgan's 100 proof. Go get a match. Find a match, so this is gonna have to do. I can figure out how to work. Okay, you ready? So, just so you know, we're going to set this on fire. Then you have to pick it up very carefully, drop it in the beer, and then you drink it. It's supposed to taste like a Dr. Pepper. So we're gonna see how this goes. Are you ready? Oh god. Well, that's not catching a fire at all. <laughs> it can't be against it get your drink if it doesn't actually catch on fire. Okay, there we go. I can hear it like singeing, but it did not want to like. Okay. All right, so last time I did three quarters amaretto, one quarter, 100 proof. Now I've done one quarter amaretto, three quarters, 100 proof. Okay, you ready? like Dr. Pepper. Okay, we're gonna have to find a different signature drink because that's terrible. That's just like uh, Bud Light with some like, I don't even know what to say. It's just not good. It's not good <laughs> So Fleming Dr. Pepper's out. I think you should just have a Captain Morgan's and a Diet Coke and we're just gonna call it a day, right? That's my signature drink. You gotta just, you know, roll with the punches. <laughs> cool and I'm gonna start the icing and then we're gonna put it on the cake like I said I did French vanilla and then we're gonna make a buttercream icing supposedly we'll see how it goes um, and then we are going to decorate the cake I think I'm gonna start decorating the cake and then let you see if you can figure out what I'm actually doing I think that would probably be the best at plan of action I'm supposed to put some water in here or something It's literally like lumps of like that fat stuff with like powdered sugar everywhere. And it's like going everywhere. All right, I give up. I'm gonna give, I'm gonna go get some more. <laughs> we'll see, hold on, hold that thought. Okay, here we go. Ooh, okay. You see the cloud? It's like I'm pig pig. That is literally doing nothing. I'm gonna have to check my recipe. <laughs> it's just literally just a bunch of powdered sugar. Hold please. Powdered sugar, teaspoons, butter. Oh, it said butter soft. Maybe I should add some water. All right, come on, we're gonna try again. Hold on. Let's look at a different recipe and see if we can find the one that I used. <laughs> challenge it wouldn't be fun. Okay. Popular recipes, quick and most. Quick and almost, that's the one we're going to, quick and easy. Why is it on these recipes you have to look through like, like they wrote an entire diary entry before they get down to the thing? 
Oh, okay, so I definitely need some water. All right, that's cool. Here we go. I'm just gonna start adding water to my heart's content. We'll see how that goes. I do have an extra icing in case those of you just cringed from me doing that. Or some extra powder. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of water. Here we go. Come on, baby. Now we're making progress. Now we're cooking. Kind of looks like Elmer's glue, so I'm gonna put in some of this stuff on the side. <laughs> you should see my floor. Holy cow. It's coming along, it's coming along. Nobody wants lumpy icing, right? I mean, at least of all me. Okay, let's see how we did. That's actually good. I can't really believe it. Oh, it's really sweet. Cake number one. Come on. Now here's cake number two. I heard that you're supposed to do, it's a little lumpy, but I'm just gonna get some anyway. And then I'm gonna pop it upside down. Alright, I'm gonna get a little more plate of sugar. Just hold on. <laughs> Dang it! I'm not gonna be discouraged. It looks super lopsided. It was round when I put it on there, but now it's all like. Alright, that's okay. It still tastes good. I'll let you know. What we're gonna do is we're gonna make a picture of Jason Kelsey on the top of this amazing cake. It already looks, you know, professionally <laughs> Okay, so I need some, let's start making icing. Ready? So we need red, yellow, and I need to make some flesh color. I'm not sure how I'm gonna do that. <laughs> that so ready. Okay, I heard if you use a toothpick, it makes it not as much. You don't want to really put a drop in because we don't need that much of the skin color. Well, maybe we do. No. Put a little more in there. I should put more in there or less in there because I'm going to go with it. Okay, you ready? I say to drop your toothpick in here and put it in the thing. One color of each, it said. I'm not sure that I agree with that, but we'll just see. Jason may have a tan. He may have a sunburn when I'm done with it. We'll see. <laughs> okay. Maybe need a little more than that. Oh. And a green. Just luck, you guys. Here we go. Yeah, that didn't work uh, at all. So maybe I need a little more. Or is that white? Is it? It still looks white. Or maybe Jason hasn't seen the sun in many years. <laughs> there could be that as well. Poor guy. Baby drop, here we go. Too much green. Oh, uh, that's kind of a big one. I don't know, we'll see. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's a lot of green. I'm not feeling very good about this at all. That is so green. All right. This may just be end up being the brown hair at this point because what do you think would make this less skinny color? It's green now. Yellow? I'm gonna give it some yellow. Maybe some red? Red? Well, I know I don't wanna do green. Okay, here we go. Red like, is... Red's gonna definitely make it brown. I need brown. 
Okay, let's just do that. Okay, this is getting better. <laughs> Did you hear my dog? My dog's like, Hurr. She's like, what are you doing over there, woman? Okay. I don't know, what do you think, you guys? I don't know that that really looks like skin, but I think that I'm just gonna stop while I'm ahead. That's what I think. What do you think? You think I should stop while I'm ahead? Yeah. Okay. It's my witch's brew. <laughs> Okay, here we go. I'm gonna go down to the edge. Okay. That does not look very skin tony. Looks <laughs> really more like a medium brown paste or hummus. That's all right. I mean, he's not gonna be at the party. He won't know, right? He won't care. He's like, oh, good job. Let's make some arms. It's pretty muscly. Ooh, I need an elbow and down. I feel you laughing. I feel you laughing. <laughs> and then elbows up. Mm. Mm. Okay. Yeah, it kind of looks like a mixture of hummus. Don't you think? Very hummusy. Mm. All right, now I'm gonna do some arms here. Oop, I got a streak of red. Hold on. It kind of looks like a turkey with me. <laughs> oh, work in progress, work in progress, people. Okay. All right, I'm gonna make it a little bit rounder in the chest area here. Big pecs, big pecs. Neck, oh, that's a good neck. There's his nose. His nose and around his face, cause he has a beard. <laughs> okay, he's got his mouth open. Ah! Right here. I gotta say at this point he looks a little like Gumby. drip here like a nipple so I gotta get that off that's not gonna <laughs> oh wait a minute I'll do the hairy thing fingers okay let's do his hat first he has on a hat so I'm gonna do the red I mean he's looking so good so far I mean what could happen <laughs> oh, he looks like a gumby doll it's terrible just terrible whoops oh here we go This, oh, this icing might be a little too soft because it's not forming at all and it's sliding down the side of the cake. So that's fun. <laughs> oh God, okay, okay. It's like a murder cake. <laughs> I'm scraping this off and I have store-bought chocolate icing and that's what I'm putting on it. So don't worry about your flaming Dr. Pepper and don't worry about your Jason Kelsey draw along. <laughs> a girl's gotta know when to call it, right? I mean, look it. Nailed it! <laughs> don't forget to subscribe for more amazing video and in the comments, tell me what you want me to make next time. Thanks guys.